Hi, this is Michael Lorraine for United College of Fashion with every man's dream to have two beautiful ladies by their sides. I'm here with... Lenisa Buena Vista. Kirsten Bayer. Hi ladies, how are you? Well, and you? Good, how about you? Good. I heard you guys had a long day. Yes. <laughs> it was a long day, but it was a fun day, so it's okay. Fun day, so... That's the model industry for you, that you're going to be up there behind bright lights, you know, a lot of eyes. Are you guys prepared? Yeah. Yeah. Yes. So when did you guys know that you, you know, that this was for you, that you wanted to be a model? Um, I was about 16, and it was the first time I ever did a runway show, mm -hmm. and it's like something just clicks, and you kind of know, like, okay, this is what I really like, like, this is what I really want to do. And for me, um, I was about 12 years old. Um, I, I went to Barbizon and just to get the experience in school, and I did my first fashion show at 14. So I've always wanted to do it. All right, I love it. So you guys are working with uh, Sandy Bass. <laughs> <laughs> so she is, you know, she had her experience, and she's instilling some uh, words of wisdom into you. What are some things that she has told you guys? Always keep going mm -hmm. is probably the most important thing. So like if you have a bad show or you have a bad shoot that you can't dwell on it, it's better to just realize what happened, take it as a lesson learned, and to just move on from it and to just do your best to make sure that it doesn't happen again, but not to just sit, think about it, and tear yourself up. Nice. That's also something that I have definitely learned from her. And also, I have just become overall a, a better model, completely. I've, I've um, learned so many things that I've never even thought of. And um, yeah, she's a really great So model. I found out that you beautiful women are walking in our show on October 17th, which is our gala. And that's uh, for our Fashion for human uh, Humanitarian Causes. What does it you know, feel to working for a show that has a philanthropic feel to it? It's very exciting. Um, I'm definitely looking forward to it for the cause, and it's a really good thing. Nice. Very good thing. Yeah, it's a good, it's a good thing to be able to tie something that you love to do, and it's something that's also a great cause all in one. So it's a really great thing. So where do you guys get your sense of fashion from? Where do you enjoy your clues? Um, favorite celebrities, of course. Yeah. My mom and then my own personal kind of like flair, personality, or style, however you want to put that in. Yeah. Okay. And to me, I definitely, um, since I'm from San Francisco, I kind of base my, my style upon that from where I live. So how far do you young ladies want to go with this? Oh boy. <laughs> nice. As far as I can. Like, I just want to be able to do everything that I've ever wanted to do and done in my yeah. So Definitely supermodel level. Supermodel level. Yeah. Yes. And do you feel that you want to do something else apart from modeling in your lives? Or if this is it? Definitely, yeah. I would love to dabble in acting. I open up a restaurant because my mom cooks, so I would love to open up a restaurant just so she can cook in it. <laughs> so I can just go there every day when I'm doing modeling and finally like be able to enjoy whatever kind of food I want to. Okay. And future goals? My future goals is also to be, become an actress, mm -hmm. which I would love to do. I think that I'm, I'm pretty good at it. It's, you know, not too bad. <laughs> so that also, and um, I am also interested in um, opening my own, own restaurant, mm -hmm. but with my own style. Nice. For, um, you know, for people that eat soul food, uh, just more upscale, because they need that, I think so. See, models do love food, you know, it's a misconception. They right? do love food. Well, you guys are awesome. Thank you so much for taking the time, you know, for the interview as well as walking for us. You know, your beautiful faces are going a long way in that we are supporting young children living with HIV and AIDS in Soweto, South Africa. And that's something beautiful that you can use your beauty to help those in need. Thank you very much for your time, girls. You guys are great. Thank you. All right, this is Mike Moreno. I'll see you at the casting call.